Keep pressure here. Hold him down. Yeah. What madness is this? Twenty years, my steward, had never a doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. Those ungodly beasts carry a curse. Throw them back or doom us all. Tie him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may yet find his senses. Come on. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? Oh, God. <laughs> All fine. Where's the rest of his leg? That's the captain. This is the doctor. Oof. There's a lot to unpack in this one. They died from... What exactly? How exactly did they die? Torn apart? Not really? I don't know. Yeah, there's a lot to unpack in this one. Ah. Killed with a sword. Yeah, it's the only weapon around. They were... Killed by sword. As for the person... There's some very interesting dialogue here. Keep pressure here. That's the doctor. Hold him down. What madness is this? 20 years my steward and never a doubt on your sanity. Explain yourself. These ungodly beasts carry a curse. Throw them back or doom us all. Tie him up and put him in the lazarette with those things. He may yet find his senses. Come on. And then the person who is somebody's steward and who killed this person then says Era Darar. I'm sure I'm totally mispronouncing that. I need to look up what language that is. It sort of sounded like they had a Scottish accent. All fines, John. All's fine, John. Who, um, who's John? That's the captain, right? No. All's fine, John. Who's who? Because there's three people here. One's the doctor, and then there's two other people. Um, let me look up what language that is. Oh! I was totally wrong about Scottish. Um, apparently it's Swedish. So, a Swedish steward. 20 years my steward and never a doubt on your sanity. I get the feeling it's the captain saying this. 
Um, let's look at the crew manifest. Who is from Sweden? Oh, yeah, there you go. That's easy. Philip Dahl, Captain Steward, from Sweden. Number 28. You are number 28. So, that means... In the dialogue, we can kind of figure out a little bit more about who's who. Keep pressure here. That's the doctor. What Madness is this? 20 years, my steward. This is the captain. This is the steward. Those ungodly bees carry a curse. This is the captain. Tie him up. Da, da, da. Come on. I think that's the person holding on to the steward. Dragging them off. This is the steward. And then I don't know who this is. All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. Where's the rest of his leg? It's one of these three people. I think. Let's see who has the name John. Hmm. I didn't even look at the whole list because I'm pretty sure that it's John Davies, fourth mate from England. What would the fourth mate look like? Well, hold on. Let's look at these people and see where they show up. All right, like, you don't look like you're wearing a fourth mate's clothes. You're the doctor. Well, shit, I don't think you're the fourth mate either. It would be one of these people, right? There's four here. Or... Oh, I mean, there's a captain, and I see three with similar hats. First mate... Third mate. You're blurry. Shit, I don't know. Who are you? Oh, you're the bosun. Could you be the fourth mate? That's the first mate. Hmm. I'm starting to feel pretty confident this is not MABA. Is there a glossary for all the different mates? <laughs> the different levels of mate? Nah. General mates helped to run the ship and serve as the at the captain's request. Hmm. Uh, you know what? There's another John. John Naples, who's a seaman from Wales. Looking through the dialogue, I feel like they're talking to the person who's had their leg sawed off, <laughs> cut off. I've seen worse. Or what exactly did they say? All's fine, John. Been in worse spots, I think. And then I think they talk to other people when they say, where's the rest of his leg? I think they're talking to the victim when they say John. And they really don't look like a fourth mate. So yes. I think that's, where did they go? John Naples. That's all of it for this floor. They're holding a couple people back. What? The hell is that? These 
They, is, it, is that a signature? Did they sign it instead of appearing in the photo or something? Who the hell are they? They're holding a book. Ah. You must be the cook or the butcher. Transporting a lot of things. And this happened location wise. Wait, I thought it would show me the location in the water. Oh, it's just the location at the beginning of the whole thing, right? Yeah, like this whole chapter, Unholy Captives, happened here, near the Canary Islands. William Wasim. That person again? Wait, no. No, no, no. I was thinking... This person. This is a different person. Third mate, Martin Parrot. Cutting people in. Ah, oh, that's the person I was thinking of before. Abraham Akbar. Do they... We haven't seen their body yet. Is that their body? Are they dead here? Okay, who the hell is this person? Is that ES, if I'm reading that right? ES? I guess it should be pretty easy to look for that in the crew manifest, right? Hmm. It's probably Edward Spratt, ES, an artist. Number 18. Oof. So it just broke their neck? Yeah, they're trying to transport... What is this? I think it's a... Maybe a catch from the sea? Or something? And they lost control of it? That person doesn't look too good.
Well, we already know who they are. They were crushed by cargo. It was cargo, right? The yeast cannon, rigging, stones. Yeah, it was cargo. Yeah, the person who exploded. You're the artist. I don't know who the hell you are. Hmm. They're holding a tool and they're coming from this tool shed. That is some valuable hints, I think. Because there's a carpenter. There's at least one carpenter on board and this person's, well, they're doing carpentry. And this person... I don't know, it looks like they were just doing carpentry, or maybe... Is there a carpenter's assistant? Let's go check. I can identify you, apparently. It's supposed to be very hard, apparently. But... Let's just check. Yeah, carpenter and... Um, carpenter's mate. Yeah, I think it's pretty reasonable to say this person is the carpenter, Winston Smith from America. And this person seems like they're helping, just judging by the tool they have in there. It's weird, some of these ones that are listed as like a difficulty of three seem pretty straightforward to me, and yet there's a lot that have a difficulty of two that I'm just like, I have no idea. Ooh. May I view any secrets from here? No. I may not. I think that's it. Yeah. This person didn't look so good either, and they died. still alive. That's why they dropped it. And yeah, it was seafood of some sort. Cursed seafood, maybe? It's got nasty spikes. I don't know what the hell that would be.
Ah, they're the one who's speaking. Give him to me and I can fry us a solid meal, boys. Okay, so they must be the cook or the butcher. That's a pretty shell here. Let's have a look. Would they be a butcher? I guess probably, right? Let's say they're the butcher. Hmm. But then again, this is the other person that I thought was the cook or the butcher, and they have an apron on. This person doesn't. Butchers always have aprons on, don't they? I think this is the cook. I missed him. Oh. Oh, here they are. Um. Their accent. The butcher's Irish. And the cook is from England. Their accent, I think, did sound... English? Pretty sure. They were... What were they exactly? Blood's coming out of their mouth. I think they were just hit really hard. I don't think they were, like, spiked. I think. Clubbed? Crushed? Crushed by a beast? No. Clubbed. Torn apart, nah. Struck? Yeah, struck. Struck by a tail. Ooh. Finally one of these. Please tell me I got them right. Oh, thank God. Which ones are correct? That is the cook. And Charles did burn to death. Hooray! Tiny bit more progress. There's a lot more progress to go. <laughs> okay, we're not quite done yet, though, because... Now that we identified the cook, we can identify the butcher. Emile O'Farrell. There are seamen. I assume all the people doing lifting like this are probably seamen. You're a seaman. Oh, that's um, Akbar. Yep, seaman as well. These two people look very prim and fancy, and you have something like a cloth over your arm. Who might you be? You're next to the third mate, so you might be like an assistant, a steward. Yes. This person's blurry, but like this might be like the fourth mate, and this might be their assistant. And this person, I think, is Martin Parrott's assistant. They're both blurry, but I'm pretty sure that's who they are. Um, what would they be listed as? Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, here. Each person's steward. So, right, we've already seen the captain's steward. That's the person from Sweden. I haven't seen them die, though. First mace steward. Um, so this person... They're blurry, but they're next to Martin Parrot. So I feel confident saying that this is Martin Parrot's steward. 
So third mate's steward. I'm going to say try anyways. I feel like I shouldn't do that, but like I'm pretty confident about this. Third mate's steward. Now this person, I don't know. Can we do it by elimination? There's the captain. First mate. First mate. Third mate. Stands to reason this is probably this. This is probably the second mate. So then this is probably the fourth. Try anyways. The fourth mate? Ooh. Yes! John Davies' fourth mate was clubbed by Henry Brennan. Emil O'Farrell, butcher, was spiked by a terrible beast. Roderick Anderson, third mate steward, was crushed by a loose cannon. See, this feels weird. The game's like, these are two triangles, and I'm like, I have no idea. But then other ones, the game's like, this is blurry. You shouldn't even try. You definitely can't figure this out. And I'm like, oh yeah, watch me. So this is definitely the fourth mate. So this is pretty definitively the fourth mate's steward. Try anyways. I feel really proud of that. There was such a delay waiting for it to say well done. I thought, oh, this must have must mean I got it wrong if it's taking so long compared to normal. But nope. Well done. Why are you like running away? What are you up to? You're the Captain Steward. Hmm, that's Charles pointing at it, being like, yo, look at that thing. Who could this person be? Their outfit is... Hmm. They have the similar coattails that Charles has, and Charles is a midshipman. But this person's other clothes are quite different. Like, the coat's the same, but they have... This thing around their neck, their pants are a different color. But it says I can identify them. How many midshipmen are there? There's three. It's probably another midshipman. Uh, well, I mean, I should clarify. There's three midshipmen listed on the list, but... It already took... Charles out of the list because they were confirmed to be correct, I believe. So in reality, there's four midshipmen, but only three that I can choose from. I have no idea which one of these it could be. And yet, apparently it's possible to know it, but quite difficult. You also look like a midshipman. Just which one? You're supposed to be easier to find. You blew up. I remember you. You blow upper. I could guess. You would literally be a guess. I'm not. I'm not going to literally guess. That just feels bad. Damn. There's a lot going on. Yep, they were confirmed to be correct. They're a topman. Something strange about this interaction here. The way this person is, like, holding this other person on their back. This person has their hand to this person's shoulder, and they're 
this person's grabbing them on the hand. Like, something is going on here. I don't know if this is some sort of, like... Uh, well, I mean, this is justice at sea. It's when somebody was being hanged. So maybe they're they're mourning. Maybe they knew this person. Maybe they're angry. Ah, I don't know. I'm supposed to be able to identify you. You are wearing the same stuff, the same stuff as other Topmen, right? So you're a Topman? I don't have any way of knowing which Topman. There's a lot of Topmans. They look, they look like they might be Chinese. Perhaps. And there's a lot of Topmans from Chinese. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of Topmans from Chinese. Let's try that again. There's a lot of Topmans from China. Four of them? Yeah, New Guinea, England, Russia. Pretty sure it's one of these four, but I have no idea which one. What's their difficulty? Difficulty's three. Feels about right. I think you also look... They're blurry for some reason, but... I think they're also a topman from... China. Well, actually... Yeah, probably. What the hell is this? You again? I keep seeing you pop up. You, I th think, are Chinese too? Probably one of the Dotman. Damned if I know who you are. You're damn big and damn strong, though. Oh. Oh. Some bodies here. This is one of the things that those... Those creatures shot out. One of the spikes. So they got spiked before they were invaded by the creatures. Oh. Oh. This is one of the, the guards of the Formosan royalty. Is this the other one? No. That's got, this is the doctor, right? I see the doctor's bag. Yes. The bosun. The I don't know. What's going on here? The captain. Third mate. First mate. So they're talking with all the different mates. But we still don't... Um... I was gonna say we still haven't identified the second mate, but like, it's got to be this person. This is the fourth mate. This has got to be the second mate. Again, they're blurry, but I'm like 99% sure this is the second mate. What was the dialogue for this? Is this... Is this still Unholy Captives? Yeah, it is. It's this one, right? Clear the deck. Careful now. Take it slow. Watch your footing. Ah, clear the deck. So this, this conversation here is from up above. Clear the deck. Move the boats astern and throw the bodies over. 
That's coming from somebody in a position of command. Clear the deck. Who looks like they could be saying that? Could be you? Who looks like they're giving orders? These people are talking amongst themselves. They're not giving orders. Yeah, yeah, I think it's this person. Which we've already identified. You know what? I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode because, well, I don't want to stop playing, but if I don't, then I just never will. Like, I meant to stop pretty much an hour ago, but I'm just so like, I want to know who that is, who is that, who is that, who is that, another memory, what exactly happened, what other creatures invaded your ship. I think I need to just stop. <laughs> this game is really, really good. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon and see how these two people died.